Welcome back, it's Stacy from Scrap Mania, and look at this delivery, Lawn Fawn Lusciousness. So we have a ton of stuff. Um, this is all going to be refills. So you guys came in, snatched up all the Lawn Fawn, and, uh, which was fabulous, but not everybody got everything that they needed. So um, this is mostly the brand new release. I think it actually might all be the brand new release. And uh, this is refilling stock. So if there's something that you missed out on, couldn't afford to get everything all in one, uh, uh, shopping trip stop in because we've got all the new lawn fun uh, back in stock So let me show what we show you what we've got um, first off. We've got this fabulous pad um, This is called nitpicky and it's a fall pad and it's got gorgeous colors in it very very pretty small prints for you card makers and then We have this stamp here called simply winter sentiments um, I have shown these before, so I'm not going to um, read them all like we have. Um, this one is Happy Fall. <clears throat> this is the cute little deer um, that coordinates onto the tiny box so you can decorate your box. And then we also have the bat, I believe. I'm not sure if that's in this pile or if we still have the bat in stock, but super duper cute. Um, you can make this fun little deer. And this one is a stamp uh, called Oh What Fun. And then you've got your coordinating die. I like these little ones because they're cute and they're cheap, um, but they're fun. So here is a for shaker cards and this is called Stitched Christmas Tree Frames. And you've got your two different size trees, you've got two different size ornaments, and then you've got your star that will coordinate with both sets of uh, sizes of trees. <coughs> Excuse me. Still sick, but I am getting better. Um, this one is your gingerbread man. And uh, you, what's nice on this one is you've got all these little decorations to decorate them with. Um, it's called Gingerbread Friends. So uh, there's hearts and swirls and bow ties and buttons. And you could just totally decorate your... Uh, uh, ginger mad, gingerbread men and women um, to the fullest. We have a Merry Christmas. All right. Oh, here's that fun little bat that I was talking about earlier when I said uh, that what to go with the deer die. So this is what the bat looks like. So you can fold his wings in and like a vampire, or you can have him out like a regular little bat. Super duper cute. Nice friendly little bat. This one is called Say What Christmas Critters. Um, these are nice and small, so if you do planners, um, they'll work in your planners, things like that. You've got all these different sentiments and your word bubbles. And then, of course, Lawn Fun does the matching die. Doo -doo -doo -doo. These are nice and cute and little too, which I think would also work uh, for people who do planners. Um, but also if you are um, doing cards and want to add lots of little uh, stuff onto them, these smaller um, elements are nice for that. So you've got these cute, adorable little elves and they've got presents and toys that could be coming out of the boxes. Um, and look at this little tape and scissors, just super cute. And then you've got all your little sentiments down below and matching die. <clears throat> this is a spooky fence um, and it's a border. I don't even think that that has to be spooky though. If it's not done in black, I think that would just be a nice fun little fence. If you do that in brown, I think you could even throw that with your farm scenes. So, um, this is the Apple, um, stackables and this is outside in stitched. So you have stitching along your outside and on your inside of um, all of your uh, different apples. And then you've got your uh, stems and your leaf. Same thing here with a Christmas tree. And then this Christmas tree actually has the little trunk as well. And you've got three sizes of trees where the, only, the other uh, package only had the two sets of trees. This one is one of my favorites from this release. It's called Winter Skies. And they did something similar to this um, a while back with a couple animals looking up. So they were like stargazing. And what I like about this one is they could be watching Santa flying overhead or watching the snow falling. So you've got your little bears here and your little foxes and um, all, your, all of your different sentiments. And this one is just super cute. And there is a matching die. 
if you're making Christmas tags or even birthday tags, um, this is a new tag set and it's got stitching on it as well. So you've got two different tags there and they are fun. And um, this is called Say What Gift Tags. And I believe that these um, little critters back here, a few, um, are the perfect size to uh, put onto these little tags. <clears throat> or you could just stamp a sentiment or something on them too. <clears throat> so this is a fun item from Lawn Fawn. Um, instead of having the scalloped on the edges of their stackables, um, they've added the scallop on the inside with stitching on the outside. So these are called reverse stitched scallops and we have them in the square. We also have them in a rectangle and then a circle. So I love this because they're totally different from everything else that they've done before. Um, ch -ch -ch -ch. This is called Simply Celebrate Winter. And you've got um, seven different border dies or border stamps. And they're really nice because they can be used by themselves or you can um, put them together as scenes and like your trees um, and your snowmen and things like that. On the slider dies that come out, um, you can stamp more than once and then like your scene just extends when you pull on those. Hopefully a lot of you know what I'm talking about since I don't have that sample card in front of me. I should have grabbed that, but I did not. Um, we have our reveal wheel back in stock. Um, this is fabulous. We have a couple samples up front um, showing you um, the reveal wheel. Here is a sample on the back. And what it is, is you have this wheel on the side, up here is where that's at, and you spin that, and then the pictures behind that little opening change. So um, this is the wheel itself, and then there are additional pieces for the wheel. So like if you want that opening to be a leaf, or a snowflake, or a pumpkin, um, those are some of the ones that we got back in stock, but we also have um, like an ice cream cone and a word bubble. Um, there's more than that. I'm forgetting some, but they're super cute. And then they have sentiments that go along with them. This one is the Reveal Wheel Sentiments, and um, it's just kind of generic sentiments that, and see how some of them are arch shaped so that they fit just perfectly in that wheel. And then we also have a uh, Christmas sentiment set that goes with that reveal wheel. <clears throat> um, this set here is called Winter Scripty Sentiments. Nice font, and you've got all different sentiments there to use. This one's been really popular. We have a bunch of samples around the store using this. Uh, pick of the Patch. And this could be for fall or it could be for Halloween. Um, just depends on if you want to add the faces onto your pumpkins or leave those alone. Um, what's nice with this set is these faces here on the pumpkins. If you're doing the reveal wheel and want little faces on your pumpkins here. Um, so when you're spinning that wheel, you can have these different items stamped. And then your face of your pumpkin will change. So that's adorable. And there is a stamp set that coordinates with the pick of the patch set. <clears throat> Excuse me. And then we have the snowfall backdrop. So this one is the horizontal, I believe, or portrait, they call it. Portrait, lawn fawn, snowfall backdrop. And then we also got the um, landscape of the same thing. So this is an older item, but since it's winter time, um, since this is a Christmas release, I thought we needed more winter stuff. So I got that. And then this is... The mini pop-up box. So this is adorable. This will actually turn a card so that when you open it into a little pop-up. So you can have anything coming out of that box. You could make that box a birthday present, a Christmas present, a wedding gift. The possibilities are endless for what you could put inside that box. So fantastic and I've heard that this is super easy even though this looks like a lot of pieces I think a lot of it's just extra stuff so like your stars and your ovals and your hearts that's just extra stuff that you can decorate your box with it's not difficult to make that card at all so that is my lawn fawn release um, I've got lots more to show you though so check back and watch more videos and thanks for shopping your local store scrap mania can't wait to have you in the store thanks